Jesse Jones, retiring Secretary of Commerce, testifies before the Senate Commerce Committee on a resolution by Senator Walter F. George to divorce the RFC Lending Agency from the Department of Commerce. The nomination of Henry A. Wallace as Commerce Secretary brings this statement from Mr. Jones. The man who holds the vast responsibilities contained in the RFC should be one of proven and sound business experience. He should be able to attract men of sound judgment with business knowledge gained from experience in business. The country has a right to expect a man in this important place whose philosophy is in line with the principles which have made our country great. Then Mr. Wallace has a chance to testify for himself. After explaining his views on the multi-billion dollar Reconstruction Finance Corporation and his hopes and plans for post-war days, he defends his ability to hold both the jobs and outlines his policies, backed by Senator Claude Pepper. The former vice president then has this to say about the RFC when he takes office. If the Congress doesn't feel that the powers of the RFC should be exercised in such a way as to carry out the objectives I have set forth here today, then I respectfully urge the Congress to take the RFC out from under the control of the Department of Commerce. For I tell you here and now that if the RFC is left in the Commerce Department, I will use its powers in the interests of all the American people.